All righty. Here we go with another fun and exciting science experiment. And here at W211, your day means one thing. Imagination Station must be here. <laughs> right. We've got a really exciting um, demonstration to do today. All that has to do with pressure. Okay. okay. So we know that force is just... I'm kind of feeling the pressure right now, all right? <laughs> don't worry, don't worry. It'll be all right. Force is a push or pull on an object, okay? okay? And pressure is that force over a certain area. So it's force per area. Okay, so in order to demonstrate that, we have this little miniature bed of nails here. Now you want to feel that? Real nails, right? Pretty sharp. Pretty sharp. Okay, so we're going to demonstrate this by applying some force onto our balloon here, onto the bed of nails. Okay, so Chris... You're going to do this, so why don't you go ahead and put your gloves on and your goggles. I have a feeling I know what's going to happen here. You, th you think? I'm no expert. Okay. All right, so we got that. And so you're going to lightly press on our balloon here. We're going to see what happens. Okay, so our balloon, oh. for the most part, right, it's squishing out, yeah. but you wouldn't, it's not popping like you would think it would. And those are nails, right? Sharp nails. Sharp nails. Well, let's say you're pushing down with about 10 pounds of force here, okay? okay? We've got 100 nails, so that means the pressure is spread out equally among the nails. So each nail is pushing back with about 10 hundredths or one tenth of a pound of force. Equally distributing that right. force. Right. Okay. Um, and we can see in contrast what would happen if we only had one nail here. Okay. Okay. So if we had one nail and all that force is being applied to that one nail, it's going to push up with 100 times the amount of force here and much easily pop, right? right. Much more easily. Okay, now Chris, we have a life-size bed of nails here that you are going to go ahead and lay on, okay? What do you think? Let's see how I fare compared to the balloon. All okay, right, go ahead. so it's my turn here, laying right. on a bed of... They're real nails. They're, They're real very nails. sharp. So. He's going to carefully get down onto those nails. Okay. Okay, situate yourself. Get nice and comfy. Comfy on the bed of nails there. Okay. Okay, I'm going to have you scoot a little bit more this way. Perfect. How's that feel? I guess as good as someone laying on a bed of nails can feel. <laughs> well, get comfy. I think you're doing pretty well so far. I'm going to have you put on this mask here, this face shield. Okay. Now, I want to add the top of the bed of nails. Are you ready, Chris? <laughs> Okay. All right, we're going to see, add a little bit more pressure here. You can go ahead and help me stabilize it a little. How's that? Perfect. Okay, now Chris, what I want you to do is cover your eyes for this next part. You're going to take your hands like this, interlock them, and put it right in front of your face. Okay, perfect. We're going to add a little bit more pressure here. I'm already feeling it. <laughs> well, we're going to add about 35 more pounds of pressure in the form of... A cinder block. Okay? You ready, Chris? Uh, I think so. All right, here's our cinder block. How's that feel? <laughs> Feels fine. Feels fine, right? A little <laughs> more pressure. So this force is being equally distributed among about 400 nails down there. So it's not, not too much pressure, but we want to do one more thing here. Do we? We have a sledgehammer. <laughs> okay. Okay, and we are going to break this cinder block on top of you. Are you ready, Chris? Uh, yeah, tell my, uh, my wife and kids I love them. <laughs> All right, here you go. Ready? Five, four, three, two, one. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> All right. So we've got some debris here. How'd it feel? Amen. <laughs> He's alive. Not too bad, right? Here, let me help you up here. Okay. So we have two things going on here that help protect you. What did it feel like? More like a big kind of thump, kind of knock the wind out of you a little bit, I, right? As soon as I get my breath back, I was holding <laughs> my breath pretty much the whole time. Well, remember, your weight was equally distributed yes. among the nails here, so it lessened the pressure on you. And another thing happened, too. Much like the crunch zone in a car that absorbs impact, our cinder block here helped absorb some of that energy of my sledgehammer coming down, so you were able to not so much feel all of the energy going into that swing. It's a real cinder block here. <laughs> it is. You just broke it over my chest. I did. That's science, right? On it's a awesome. bed of nails. <laughs> and you, you're alive to prove you it. You guys are amazing. <laughs> so you guys are going to be doing all kinds of fun and exciting experiments out at the Imagination Station. You have the Sesame Street, the body coming in town. Also, the bash is coming up this weekend. Yes. Tell me a little bit about, about this. Bash. The bash is our annual adult-only fundraiser. Um, it's this Saturday, October 6th. It starts at 7 p.m. 
And tickets are still available. You can get them um, online or at the door. And it's a lot of fun. We're really excited about it. The casualties here of another fun and exciting science <laughs> experiment. You guys always put me up to stuff like this. Love it, love it. Melissa, when's it your turn? <laughs> Never. You're Never. the science guy. <laughs> would you? Would you get down on a bed of nails? Yeah, I would do it. Okay. Well, we you got did a good job. We, we'll, we'll have, have to. We'll have we to have a commercial break that. coming up, <laughs> yeah. so we're gonna have to test that. I don't you, see any more cinder blocks over there. You're all innocent, sitting <laughs> over there, thinking you're free from this. I don't think so. We'll get you over here. It's fun, exciting. I promise you. So you guys are always doing great stuff. So appreciate you coming down and sharing some more.